my name is Trisha Anderson and I work for the Agency for Substance Abuse Prevention. I'd like to welcome you back and thank you for joining us for the September podcast. Today we will be talking about September being National Recovery Month and the Recovery Rocks event that ASAP has going on. We have partnered with two other agencies, ROS, which stands for Recovery, Recovery Organization of Support Specialists, and Self-Recovery Detox to bring this event to you this year. I have a special guest with me from Self-Recovery Detox and her name is Jennifer Gentry and I'm going to allow her to introduce herself and talk about her, the company that she works for a little bit. Hello, thank you for having me this morning. Thank you for being here. My name is Jennifer Gentry. I'm the Outreach Manager for Self-Recovery Medical Detox. Um, we have three locations here in the state of Alabama, Aniston Center in Utah. If you guys are looking for medical detox, you can reach us at 1-866-255-3350. Or if you have just any questions about medical detox, you can contact me at 256-294-3371. Um, at Self Recovery, we do assist in transportation and we do have certified addiction counselors on all three units that does groups with the patients. Um, but if you have any questions, like I said, you can give me a call as well. Perfect. How long have you been with Self Recovery Detox? Um, a little over two years now. Two years. Mm -hmm. And you took over Marby's position? Yes. As so the you got kind of promoted? Mm -hmm. Cool. Um, all right. September is National Recovery Month, and every year we celebrate those who have battled substance misuse and have regained control of their lives. For those who are still struggling, it is never too late to seek out help and get the proper attention you need to put yourself on a better path. Agencies like Ross and Self Recovery Detox are among many in the state of Alabama standing by to help you make the right choice and get you on the path to recovery. September is indeed a month to celebrate this feat and to shed light on the stigma surrounding substance misuse and mental health. And I'd like to ask you, what does September and National Recovery Month mean for you? Um, I am a person in long-term recovery, so September is always a great month um, for me. Um, it means a lot, you know, that one day or one month out of the year that recovering people are basically just saying, hey, let's let's have a good time. Let's show everybody you can have fun in recovery. Let's celebrate what you yes. guys go through. Yes. Um, Marby's been here a couple of times, and she's talked a little bit about things that she's gone mm -hmm. through. And I know the, thing, the one thing that she always says that stands out to me is you do recover. Yes. It is obtainable. It can happen, but it's a lot of hard work. Yes. Yes. Recovery is absolutely the hardest thing that I've ever done in my life and so worth it. Yes, absolutely. I was just speaking with somebody in the court system this morning and I told them I said I did not realize life could be as amazing as it is today. Um, I spent 20 long years in active addiction um, and I've got a little over three and a half years now and I can't even imagine picking up that drink again. You know, as long as I do um, my 12-step meetings and continue into sobriety, it's, it's amazing. Well, that is awesome, and we're proud of you. Well, thank you. Very proud of you. Thank you. <laughs> Where there is pain, there is also hope. Opioid overdose can happen within one to three hours. Narcan takes effect within minutes. It is not a controlled substance, and it's available to anyone. Call ASAP today for more information. And remember, overdose does not have to be fatal. The Good Samaritan Law protects people from being arrested when they call 911 and stay on the scene. Hope. Hold on. Pain ends. <laughs> All over the country, people are celebrating National Recovery Month, and ASAP, Self Recovery Detox, and Ross are doing so with a three month long event that will kick off September the 1st. We will be hiding rocks all around Calhoun County for community members to find. There will be 15 special rocks uniquely marked to represent prizes. If you find these rocks, you will call the number listed on them and set up a time to bring them by and exchange them for a prize. Five of those prizes will be given by our agency, the Agency for Substance Abuse Prevention. Five of those prizes will be given by Ross, the Recovery Organization of Support Specialists, and the remaining five by Self Recovery Detox. Yes. And our rocks have, are, they're gonna be white and they're marked with numbers 
Um, they're numbered, so number six and number two is what I have here to show you. And then on the back of them, our phone number is on it, and you'll call our office, and we are in and out of the office. Um, prevention is not done in the four walls of this building. It is done out in the community, so if you get our um, voicemail, please leave your name, your number. Let us know that you found a rock, and if you remember to tell me what number it is, and we will call you back and set up a time where you can come and bring that rock to our office and exchange it for a prize. But you do have to bring the rock, and you have to give it back to us. Um, I'll let Jennifer talk about her rocks. So our rocks will be a lime green color. They will have our 866-255-3350 number on the back of the rock. It will also say prize rock. Um, you'll just need to call that number, which is a 24-hour line, um, and let one of our intake specialists know that you have found the prize rock. You'll bring it to our office, and you will receive a prize for it. Awesome. And I know ASAP has a hundred rocks that we're hiding. So out of that hundred, five of them are prize rocks. How and many? we've got 50 rocks and there's five prize rocks. Okay. And I think uh, Dina with um, the Recovery Organization of Support Specialists, they're also doing 50 rocks and five of those rocks are going to be prize rocks. Uh, she was unable to attend today. I was supposed to have her here as well, um, but she's at home sick, so she couldn't make it. In closing... <clears throat> We would like to thank you for watching our podcast and invite you to like our Facebook page, Agency for Substance Abuse Prevention. Follow us on Twitter and Instagram. Visit our website, asaprev.com. Email us at agencyabuse at gmail.com or you can call us at 256-831-4436 for more information. We are always happy to help you get connected with agencies that offer treatment and or counseling services or provide you with educational prevention materials, whatever you might need. Thank you for tuning in today and thank you, Jennifer, for coming. Thank you for having me. Yes, ma'am. It's been fun. Thank you.